So the second episode of Trailblazer is all about Barrow's progression, our first stepping stone into PVM in this league. And before we get there though, just gotta do some final preparations. But yeah, lots of good gains. If you guys are excited for the PVM content in this upcoming league for the series, definitely give the video a like. Otherwise, enjoy the video. Hey, I got a lot of uh, stuff done uh, in this AFK session, you know, working on the video. I got 70 fishing, 70 woodcutting, and also by extension, a ton of willows and lobsters for cooking and fletching and fire making too, that I can use later. Alright guys, just woke up, had a good sleep, so it's time to game hard. So, while I was doing all my AFK stuff, we already uh, reached enough points for the third relic. So yeah man, let's go and select our third relic. It's going to be quick shot. It's going to be perfect for barrows. Oh, nice. Okay, we just hit 40 range. I think that's sufficient because at 40 range, I can get myself you, you bow. I need about 200 bow strings in order to reach 53 fletching, and with the plus 12 boost, will be 65 for the U long, and I can easily get that through temple trekking. So let's go ahead and do some. On the easy track, I can just evade all the monsters. So <laughs> we're gonna actually have no trouble doing this at all. All right, just finished some easy uh, temple trekking. Man, that's crazy. I just got 200 just like that. It took like less than, f I don't know, four minutes, man. Easy trek. Yes, 65 because of the boost. So you short bows unlocked, boys, let's go. Alright, hopefully that's everything. Yep, good day's work. Nice. Okay, we got some fossils. Nice, I completed this. Okay, that is easy. Diaries done. Very nice. Okay, let's grab the easy stuff. Did it just give me 40? There we go. Alright, I needed that for uh, Karamja gold. So that's perfect, we got that. Alrighty, we are done. Let's go. Finally, we can use all these lamps. Achievement diary. Yes. Perfect. Okay. So this one uh, doesn't have any limitations to use. So I can just use it right away. Boom. Instantly. Oh, pff, what? Well, I can already uh, make prayer pots. Just like that. Let's go with this. Nice. No regrets, man. Let's go. Send it all. 54 herbler. How are we doing? Nice. Okay. So with 54, I can make a lot of other stuff too. Okay. There we go. We got the U short bow now. All right. We go up. There's a ladder. There's a third floor. Mysterious third floor. Maybe even more. Ah, secret spot. Oh, Chaos Druids and Chaos Druid Warriors. Oh, damn. Looks like getting prayer pots won't be the hardest thing ever. Oh, we just hit a thousand uh, total level. Very nice. But yeah, we're almost ready for uh, barrows. Just uh, finalizing some runes and prayer pots. So we're almost ready to go. Yay. Okay, 50 range, guys. Sick. Now we can wear this. Awesome. All right, guys. Let's go gear up for barrows. I'm ready. All right. I just cooked lobsters, too. Uh, this is also points. And I need them for barrows. So I think I'm ready now. I got the food, the prayer. Aya. Uh, what am I missing? 55 Slayer. Are you kidding me, bruh? I should have known that the Skilling Prodigy plus 12 wasn't gonna let me wear the staff. Usually they don't let you wear stuff with boost, but it's okay, I have a backup. I'm gonna go ahead and use the Blast Spells. I can use uh, Fire Blast pretty soon. So that should be fine. It's pretty much the same DPS anyways. And I also have the Fairy Ring. So I can't use the last recall just yet because I have to go to barrels first and then teleport out of it to save the location. Then we can just keep cycling back with last recall. It's gonna be so OP. Okay, here we are. Let's go with our first uh, first try at the barrels run. Hopefully it works out well, man. Hopefully it works out well. So just to reiterate, because it's really important, now that I have tier three relic unlocked, Unique items like barrels armor and stuff. They are now twice as common. They're usually 1 in 17 But with you know the relics Passive it's actually about 1 in 8 now. So yeah, even if I do them slow 
I can probably rack up eight barrels runs within, I don't know, an hour or two. So what am I looking for? Mainly just armor pieces like the top and the bottom. Arums or something would be super nice. Because I don't really have any good mage, you know, in these regions. But anything really, I can at least out even if it's a sucky drop. So let's hope for the best. Alright, I'm low on prayer and I don't really want to use my prayer pot. So we're going to use the uh, super secret trick with the uh, last recall. We're going to get some free prayer back. Because... The Lumbridge uh, has an altar right right outside, so it's going to take a bit to run these laps, to run these rounds, but it's okay. I, I get to save a lot of prayer. So we're going to go and, uh, yeah, get some prayer back and then go right back using last recall. So, oh, this is super close. So it's actually really nice. It's actually very, very nice. And then we come back and we got our prayer back. Very nice. Alright, this is where the interesting part happens, because we are gonna do the one, the two tick MSB. Alright, let's see how Arms does. Alright, we are, uh, we're hitting still, you know, we're hitting. With 50 range. Man, it's still kind of slow, but... Okay, okay, we're, we're doing stuff. <laughs> 11, nice, nice, nice. It's a good thing I locked Eagle Eye, because that is really... Really nice. Okay, this is a bit harder than I thought. The stats are, are uh, definitely a bit harder. But Arams, though, that was pretty good, you know? That was pretty good with Arams. Nice, now we can finally use Fire Vest. Oh, I'm dying. Okay, we're gonna have to safe spot this guy. He's destroying us. <laughs> so, pretty standard barrows at the top. I just mage the melee guys and carols, and I ranged Arams. Luckily, our range relic is super OP, so we can get away with really bad setup. And for the tunnels, I try my best to spawn the remaining brother in the long haul corridor because if I do that, there's safe spots for both sides. And yeah, I just safe spot the melee guy. If it's Arams and Carols though, I pretty much have to use prayer no matter what. Just because I can't tank for my life right now with my stats. First chest, boys. One in eight chance to get a drop. Here we go. Oh, death runes, I'm happy. It doesn't matter if I don't get a draw because I can keep going and doing barrels. So this one's going to be better with fire, fire Blast. Let's get it. I need a teleport out here so I can reset my last recall so I can come back here after I bank. So I got to do this every time, but it's okay. At least I don't have to walk in this mode. So it, it kind of bounces out. Okay, second chest. One in eight chance. Here we go. Oh, okay, more more death runes. Okay, and we'll take it. We'll take it. I'm okay with that. Wait, looks like I'm winning. His two tick D skim is nothing against my Chad Fire Wave, my Fire Blast. Oh, I won, dude. Get wrecked. And I started later too as well. All right, okay, third chest. All right, I'm itching for an item, so please come on. Elite Clue Scroll, but I am still breaking even on the runes, uh, and I can't do this Elite Clue Scroll anyway, so. Okay, we're on the fourth one. I'll probably uh, stop recording these after the fifth one. Besides Uniques, of course. Here we go. Please! Again, back-to-back -back Elite Clue. Holy shit. What, can I do this? Wilderness? Can't do it. Man, it's so hard to do this. Huh. Okay, let me see if I can safe spot him. My brain is big. Okay, this uh, will be like the number five. Number five, here we go, please, item. No, I don't get death runes either, but this is a lot of money though. For now, I can I can use some money. So I'm currently sustaining all my spells through barrels, but sometimes it gets a little sketchy, but I have unlocked Wind Wave, which is stronger than Fire Blast anyways, and that means I can use the Blood Runes I get too. So now I should be completely fine, self-sustainable on the spells. Oh my god, skeletons, why? Drop and get out. Oh, let's go! Okay, we got a good drop, let's go! Got them chain skirt, let's go. I need to get to 70 defense immediately. Let's freaking go, dude. Only took twice, almost twice the drop rate. Yes, let's go. I'm gonna keep going until my, uh, my food runs out. I'm almost out of food, but yes, dude. The moment, the moment we've been waiting for, yeah. Yes. Okay, we done. Let's go. Infinite run energy is so nice. Here we go. Back to back. Ah, okay. Nah, I wish. Here we go. Here we go, boys. 
<gasps> oh my god, no way, dude. Oh, two skirts. Oh my god, two skirts. Holy shit. I mean, I'm definitely using the Varax plate skirt with the Guthans, but... Two skirts, though? Wow, dude. Wow. Okay. Damn. Okay, I mean, the Varax skirt is definitely, uh, in my opinion, as a single standalone item i i'd say it's better so this is a uh, not bad that's a pretty good drop man i'm i'm, I'm happy okay so i don't want to stay at barrels for too too long i just kind of see what i what i could get early on you know to help me uh with my more long-term goals but but yeah i'm happy i'm happy uh we did 15 barrels chests. it was a good experience i i might be back here you know in the future when i have better stuff so we can do this faster it's time to work towards unlocking our next area. We're only 28 tasks away. And there's a bunch of things I can do. So uh, I think I'm going to go for like, you know, base 30s. And yeah, get a lot of points through scaling real quick. So I'm going to work on a lot of stats. We got room crafting to do, smithing to do, and everything else that needs some more work. So we're going to polish those skills up and get a points. Okay, you're probably wondering, why the hell am I here? Oh god, it's going to hurt. What's the damage? What's the... What's the casualty? Ow, 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 that hurts. But it's necessary, because uh, I'm trying to do this gas task. I've tried so many things, and I uh, can't get a silver sickle anytime soon, so... These guys drop uh, Mortmire Fungus, so I can actually add this to the Druid Palette to kill some gas. Alright, we got uh, enough mushrooms. Wait, 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 don't run away! What?! Wow, man, this this gam is stupid. Okay, nice. All right, I'm gonna drop this for now. Can I get it back? I think it's important to remind people that if you buy something from the shop, a normal shop, you can actually close the shop so that it's uh, immediately back to full. Because look at this, price is two, right, for bronze arrows, but I open it up, it's recharged. So I just do this every time, and yeah, save myself a lot of money. I get to buy twice the bronze arrows doing it this way. Especially in the early game when money is a an issue, so. But yeah, I'm about to set up for some AFK uh, range training to edit a video. So yeah, it's worth it. Holy shit, my acorn's done. So uh, I've led two acorns die, which is really sad. And uh, I could have avoided it probably, because you can make ultra compost. So in the future, when I do this, pet future trees, I am definitely... Uh, going to ultra compost so it's simple you just buy pineapples or whatever and then uh, from the super compost you just mine the volcanic ash and yeah you're good you got super compost so while i was doing some temple tracking i killed some snakes and i was able to get some snake skin and this is nice because i can actually make myself snake skin boots and uh, also uh, i can make some other stuff but I can just buy like green dehyde and stuff. So for now, we'll just make the boots if I need to make some more stuff that I can't get elsewhere. Uh, yeah, we'll make more. Thank you guys for watching today's video. If you found this video to be enjoyable, consider giving it a like. We also have a friends chat. Feel free to join that if you want to hang out. And also consider subscribing and ring the bell. That way you will get all video notifications. And if you have Amazon Prime, feel free to subscribe on twitch.tv slash ricecup and you can financially support me for free through Amazon Prime. Anyways, thanks for watching. See you guys later.